There is a very lengthy hadith of the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam reported by Hazrat Abu Huraira radhiyallahu ta'ala and who in Muslim I will be comprehensively explaining the hadith in my own words the message of the hadith is that the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said that anyone who possesses gold and silver and does not pay the due zakat then on the day of the judgment the gold and silver will be made into plates and they will be heated in the fire of the hell and with these plates the forehead and the side and the backs of the person who did not pay zakat on them they will be they will be stigmatized and whenever the plates will get cool they will again be put in the fire and then this punishment will be meted out to him for the whole day whose duration will be 50000 years till the cases of all the human beings will be decided and they will find their way either to the paradise or to the hell then the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said if any person who possessed camels and did not pay the due zakat on the camels then he said the camels will come <coughs> he said that the camels will come they'll be they'll be fat fatter they, than what they were in the earth in the life in the world they will be fat and they will healthy they will have healthy bodies and not even a child of the camel will remain behind and they will do what they will trample him with his feet and they will bite him with his teeth and he will yell and when one camel will go back the other will come and this procedure will continue for 50000 years and then he will find his way either to the hell or to the paradise and then if people were given cows and sheep and they do not pay zakat then he will also be laid with his face downwards and the cows and sheep they will come the sheep will be they will have sharp pointed horns and they will poke him with his horns and they will trample him with their hooves and the process will continue the whole day whose duration will be 50000 years till the cases of all the human beings will be decided and he will find his way either to the paradise or to the hell prabhu ibn li ainda ka paitan fil janna allahumma ajirna min an-nar then hazrat ahna bin qayf radhiyallahu ta'ala and who reports in muslim that the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said warn those warn those who heap wealth warn of what of a scar which will be inflicted on their backs and pierced through their sides astaghfirullah rabbi and then on the nape of their necks and pierced through their foreheads astaghfirullah rabbi استغفر الله ربي من كل ذنب واتوب اليك استغفر الله ربي من كل ذنب واتوب اليك prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam has reported in a hadith hadith reported by hazrat anas radhiyallahu ta'ala anhu in tabrani that the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said mani us zakat yawm al qiyamati fi nar the defaulter of zakat will burn in the hell fire on the day of judgment اللهم لا تجعلنا منهم والله make us not one of them and then the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam has prophesied hazrat buraida radhiyallahu ta'ala anhu reports in a hasan hadith of tabrani that the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said those those people those nations those communities those countries those 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 societies who neglect and do not pay zakat will have to suffer calamities like famine so famine strikes strikes countries and societies where people stop paying their zakat and people all the people in all the society becomes a, a society of miserly people and they stop paying zakat then allah stops the rains and drought strikes them and then famine strikes them prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said in a hadith a true hadith tells us the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said that every morning and every evening two angels in the heaven supplicate two angels in the heaven supplicate and they say oh allah multiply the wealth of those who spent in the path of allah 
And O oh Allah, destroy the wealth of those who do not spend in the path of Allah. So this is the punishment and this is the curse and this is the supplication of angels on the hell, on the, in the heaven for the people who are miserly in the rights of Allah.